now take care of yourself. And those types of girls are the ones that go outside and be like, oh no, I can't do this thing. Oh no, like, I, can't, I can't touch this. Mm-mm, this if thing if, if you want to be very clean, be clean ah. to the core. Hi guys, what's up guys? Welcome to JVTS Explore episode 8 on iPad TV. So today, I am your host, Abonini and this is my co-host, Sound Life Ola. So guys, we'll be talking about why students prefer to stay off campus. But before we get into that, do well to follow us on all our social media platforms at iPen TV. And do not go anywhere, we'll be right back. And don't forget to subscribe. Yeah. Hey there folks, this is Mike Fox, Flash Design Works, filmmaker director, producer, and creative for over 25 years. I am excited to have you uh, right away. Just go subscribe to iPan TV. Uh, it's fantastic and uh, uh, just amazing content. So do it right away. Don't even hesitate. Just push the button and subscribe. Let's dive into the topic for today, which is why do students prefer to stay off campus? Baby girl, would you like to like tell us more? Why do you think students like to stay off campus? Number one is privacy. Oh, that's the first and most important thing. Privacy is very important, Tabe. The sharing of the truth. Oh, I really I, hate that part of it, but what can man do now? We have to stay there for staying sick. So the fact that they always intrude your privacy, let's say you want to change your outfit before somebody just push the door and badge it. Even <laughs> if you want to manage the bedroom. Like when you guys already make rules, like this person is washing, this one is the same, this is it's going to stay that outside. Like, they they don't stick agree. to plans. If you be like, okay, well, let's make plans. We have already scheduled. Okay, you are going to wash on Monday, you are going to wash on Tuesday. So avoid some kind of misunderstanding between the, like group of people. There are six stubborn people inside there that will refuse to wash the bathroom when it's yeah, they are naturally dirty. Naturally dirty and stubborn and at the same thing. time. I don't know because it, that, that's a very, very dirty attitude. If you have a change, it's that's not fair at all. It's not funny. Don't you guys hear infection? <laughs> the person is one big thing. The person has to come and knock on the door. Call, 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 call. I want to come inside. If you just come and you will not know. It's when you start itching, when you start going out. Like, when you start going out, you will itch. Yeah, you scratch, you scratch, you scratch. That's very, very bad. We need to start keeping our hostel, like, very, very hygienic. And privacy. Girls are usually bad into the bathroom without knocking or into the room. Please learn how to knock. <laughs> the second one is actually the kind of roommates you have. There are some that have very like they have bad order when i mean bad order they are green is 90. <laughs> they have bad order, order they cannot take care of yourself and those types of girls are the ones that go outside and be like oh no i can't do this thing oh no like, I, can't, I can't touch this Mm-mm, this if, thing is if that. you want to be very be clean, clean be clean ah. to the core don't just wash your clothes and go out try and be buying deodorant please Buy jewelry and buy some perfume. Look good. Smell nice. Even in your room, self, make sure that the thing is very, very clean and hygienic. Please. To avoid some kind of thing. And the next one we're going to is Steph. Ew. Ew. That one. They will be stealing you. Yeah, you know, yeah. I see ladies stealing. I was like, I'll be like, uh uh-uh. uh. These are ladies though. Ladies die. Can I share an experience? I had an experience. I had an experience of when a lady stole um, another lady's pants or a tight outside. She went outside and get stolen. They know it's a girl's who say now. So yeah. girls are allowed to be like something like short Fine. and walk we'll around. around. You know, yeah, that's girls, that kind of stuff. Then the lady saw it on her and was like, that's my type of thing. That's very, very embarrassing. embarrassing. That's very, very embarrassing. It was like, no, it's not yours. I could tell you where I got it from. I could do this, I could do that. And literally, the lady was lying because the girl who bought the product was like very, very sure. This thing belongs to me. Why would you steal it? I've lived for it for a very long time then. We just had to fight and a lot of issue, which the coordinator was later able to sort out. That was my but that was a very, very big time disgrace. Like, I just remembered my experience. There was a period where I went to spread my clothes outside. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I came. Remember I came. I saw that the clothes are ready to slap <laughs> Why are you stealing clothes? Like, some girls are being very, 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 very,
Oui, c'est un peu de de When you have something, you don't know the words. When you lose the glass, then you, you have a nice lot of drilling. Drilling, rain, then washing it and putting it to bed. And the fact that you are not scared, you are the They have in mind that you don't understand this kind of thing. Ah, you want a morale. You should try and be changing a bag. Next one is noise. Oh! Those girls have some things wrong with them. Let's let's just talk about nine o'clock. Nine o'clock because we've never been to the male hotel, hotel yeah. before, so we don't know what it's like there. So we're going to talk about our experience majorly as a female and what it's been like because we've actually been in the hotel before. We know what it actually like feels like to be there. So they make a lot of noise. The noise there is Honest. too much. I want the period, the period of sleeping around that nine o'clock. Right? <laughs> it looks like That's if you're a bad day, I won't have to sleep there around one o'clock, and I'll be like, Jesus, what Why are you doing hell? around one? What are you doing around one? Or that's when they would decide to settle their beef that they have been having for a very, very long time. Okay, there was this um, stuff that happened in the host. I think around Sofu I was already asking them to stay here and shout. I was like, oh, let me run out of the hostel low in case something wants to like swap. Then guess what was happening? The lady was fighting and that lady upstairs just because of according to her, she was speaking to her man. She was fighting with her because of a guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it makes me. There was one issue that happened at night, and they were fighting because of rope. This is my rope, yeah. That makes me. At night, and that is something you enter. Oh, they left that to do. That to do. They were made to fight. They just left that to do. It's like they think if you touch them the on their head, they will think you they ask you. They will not say anything to you. At night, when everybody's asleep, or maybe probably like the ones that have um, boyfriend and girlfriend, and say like talking to themselves. That's when you hear the noise. Shena, you be that abi. You think you can do this and get away with it? Like girls, stop doing this. You guys are disturbing our peace. You guys are disturbing us. We have a lot of things to do, a lot. And I think I don't even think I know a lot of people go out of campus because they actually want to like have the freedom to do a lot of things, go see their guys, guy. party. Like they don't know that the reason why there are some rules and regulation is actually because so they could actually say guide them or some certain yeah. kind of thing. Freedom is good, but to some certain extent, it's freedom actually be limited. Yes, it's actually bad. So they do a lot of like bad yeah. stuff outside. At night, they usually go out at night. It's not bad though. Don't get me wrong. Though. Have fun, catch your cruise, but set boundaries, have limits, no things to do at the appropriate time and things not to do at the yeah. appropriate time. And there are some kind of night parties you, uh, you like, you attend, uh, you vow to never attend a night party before. So, ladies, please, I'm begging you, maintain yourself, like, maintain yourself, just respect yourself. There should be a level of self respect as a lady. Yes, yeah, that's true. There, there should be like, a kind of the respect a guy should give you whenever I see you. Oh, more, I respect that girl so much. He doesn't have a reason, like, he doesn't know what to do. He doesn't want to say, okay, I respect her because she's beautiful. He just, I respect her because of her personality, the way she carries herself. She has, like, she has respect towards every single person. And it shouldn't be about pride. Don't be prideful. Don't be proud, okay? Just be like, be very, very humble and honest out there. Do your stuff, have fun, catch your cool. So guys, we'll be rounding up here today. Yeah. Catch us here next week on iPad TV, JPTS Explore. <laughs> and we we'll hope to see you guys next week. Yeah. We have interesting, interesting topics to talk about. And don't forget to follow us on all our social media platforms. And, and don't forget to subscribe right. and like, share. Share to your family, share to your friends, share to every single person at iPad TV. Woo.